I couldn't believe it. I could not believe it. That big elk, our dream come true. <laughs> we put in for how many years to draw on that hunt? I grew up in a little mining town in Mammoth, Utah. And growing up there as a kid was the most wonderful thing. We spent our days, take a picnic lunch, go on the mountains and hike and outdoors. And, and that's just how it was. I first went hunting with my father when I was a little girl. So we hiked up the mountainside near our home. And I just remember trailing along with him. And then I went with my husband for quite a few years after we got married. Our son, Stephen, was old enough to hunt. And so I began going with him. I just loved being there and I would love to go and beat the bush for him. I'd go through the brush and make noise and try to push the animals out so that they could shoot them. My mom started hunting most likely for the same reasons I did. You know, somebody older, a caregiver, her father, my father, enjoyed going out. Let's say you're walking through the snow and you notice how far they can step and you're trying to stretch and walk in their steps. It's got nothing to do with hunting, really, but that's what you're doing, and that's what pulls you to the outdoors, so. One time when we were all out deer hunting, brother-in-law asked me, Elaine, you like this so much, why don't you hunt? And so that's when I decided that I would do it. Pretty soon we're buying deer tags and she's coming out on the deer hunts. Uh, it never ventured to small game, but she started hunting deer until we started venturing into elk a little bit later on. I probably first started hunting on, with a gun when I was in my mid to late 40s. I taught her how to shoot as near as I can recall, and she was a good shot. It didn't take a lot of teaching. Most of the teaching was how to safely handle a gun. <laughs> Did it go? <laughs> I'm going to say you're two inches to the left. A little to the left? Yeah. She hasn't had much problem catching on shooting. You know, I'm grateful for her, uh, that both my parents have good enough health that they can get around and do a lot of these things. <laughs> 